It looks like LNG is going to be a big, big part of that, right? That's the marginal molecule now uh, that you can export and move. Electricity you can't move, right? But LNG you can move. And is it a renewable resource? No, but it's cleaner than oil and it's better than coal. And so that looks like where we're going for for a decent amount of time. And you bring that back to, well, we got a lot of LNG in Canada. We got to get it out though. And that's going to be very important for our economic development. You say it's about energy and there'll be those trying to square that with emissions. You know, does does energy equal emissions? Is is there a kind of exact correlation, you know, or is there that idea that there's a detachment through renewables where we're going to have all that energy, but not the emissions. And that's going to be the thing that allows the standard of living we have to be continued. You know, we've heard that for a long time. Is that how it's actually playing out in the real world? The emissions question is an interesting one because it gets back to which emissions are you measuring, right? Because if you look at an electric car, well, there's no emissions. How can this be worse or not significantly better than an internal combustion or maybe a gas powered vehicle or LNG? Some of them are around. How can that not be better? 